Well, that's not good. That's oil out of Bubba Yega. We knew we had a slight issue, but one of our friends came up with a catch can for us. I don't know if you can see that, it is entirely filled with oil.
everyone, Neil here. So most of this video was shot by my son, John. And then I end up spending several hours upon hours in order to go and make these videos and put them together. And somewhere along the way, out of my own creation, it became a job. And let's be honest, jobs aren't fun most of the time. So, I think this will probably be my last full-blown let's compile everything video that I'll be posting. But I haven't decided whether I will stop paying John $20 a race to go out and film the starts and everything. I like having John there, and I like the fact that he's learning to have a work ethic, and I like the fact that sometimes the racers will go up and they'll give him his favorite moxie soda, or a couple of guys, apparently the, ra the last race that we were at, one guy gave him a $5 bill, somebody else gave him a couple of bucks, by the time John got done with filming that race, he had ended up with two free sodas, I think he had like $12 in his pocket, and at nine years old, that's a great thing. So I don't really want to lose that aspect of John's life. So in all honesty, what I think I'm going to do from here on out is probably, I will offer to John to be able to borrow my phone and be able to do the filming like he has been, and still offer him the same $20 that I've been offering him. It's just instead of compiling and taking the, the hours to go and be able to make a video like this, I will probably just straight outright upload them to the Thunder Valley Facebook group. And that's where you will probably see John's video work from here on out until... He either gets old enough to understand how to edit them into full-blown videos himself, or things change in the future in the way that YouTube works and stuff like that. But as it is, this will probably be the last video where I compile everything into one giant video, and I'll probably go back to doing dedicated build update videos on RCG Racing, and go from there. It's been a great run over the last few years, and I'm going to continue to be racing with the group. I intend to still be doing my redneck crazy builds. I intend to still break the mold on what's normal in the group, but taking four to five hours to make videos like this, unfortunately, that's a job. And I never intended RCG racing to be a job. I intended it just to be where my family posts up some racing fun. So feel free down below to join the Thunder Valley group in order to be able to see when John posts up his videos and stuff that I'll be posting on his behalf. And feel free to give him a thumbs up and a pat on the back if he's doing his filming at the events and stuff like that. As a parent, I really appreciate all of you that have supported John in this. But I need to go back to having fun with the racing. And that's where I'll be. Thank you, everybody. We'll see you in the next video.